All right, well, we have Tyson Fury right here. I know that you want to unify this championship as Tyson comes in right here. You guys have exchanged some tweets. Listen, there's only one Tyson Fury. What you got to say about that, Deontay? What you got to say about Hold that, on a my second. man? Hold on a second. Let's keep this civil here. Would you we like all, to fight? We all know uh, Fury. You just, you just a phony, man. This is just for act. You know where I am. You know what time. You know what place. I ain't scared of nobody. I'll come in your backyard, baby, for that, my man. I promise Listen, you that. Anytime when you, you, you up in the ring with a real when fighter, ready, when you in the ring with a real fighter, that's when what it's ready, all about, man. Squad, no you know bother. No bother. Listen, anytime, any place, anywhere, I'll fight you in your backyard. And right. Like a dumb clinch go. I'll beat you, you bum. You're a bum. Well, that might not have been a good idea. <laughs> you know, it's all, it's all, it's all, we, we already know he's, this is just an act, baby. You're not a real fighter. This is an act. I don't put, I don't play this. I don't play this. As you can see, baby, I'm from, I don't play this, man. This is just an act that you're doing. You should be an actor. But when we do step in this ring, this ain't wrestling. This ain't the WWE, baby. When you do step in this ring with me, if you do, because this could have been done a long time ago, you can, you can run around like you're a preacher and all that you want, but baby, I promise you, when you step in the ring, I will baptize you. There is an, another truly great fighter here tonight who's your size, Sugar Shane Mosley. What are the possibility that we see that fight in the near future? Well, uh, uh, well um, Shane Mosley, Shane Mosley is one hell of a fighter. And I, I don't take that away from Shane. You know what I'm saying? I let, I let uh, Al Heyman and Leonard Ellaby conduct my bouts and then we'll go from there. I'm not, I'm not scared of Shane Mosley, I'm not scared of no fighter. We just want to get it on, that's all. I mean, the fans want to see a great fight, me and, me and Money Midweather. Let's get this on. Let's do it. Well, it's like this. It's, 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 hey, yo, wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. I, wait, wait. All right, that's it. Hold on. Every, Bernard, everybody calm down. Floyd, Floyd. Shane, please, Shane, please. Floyd, let's concentrate here. Let's concentrate. You good. Good fight. Bernard, please. No, 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 wait. I can't interrupt you when you're doing your interview. Don't disrespect me. Respect me as okay, a man. Okay, okay, okay. Shake hands. Good. Play basketball. Now, Floyd. Respect me as a man. Now, Floyd. Shane, not now. Manny Pacquiao. I thought that would get your attention. I my attention. I know what I can do. I know what I bring to the And you show what you can do tonight. Let me ask you about the selection of Marquez as the opponent. It seems that... The thing is this. I'm going to do the talk because you do too much talking. The thing is this. All right, let me, Jim. Let me, let, me, let me do something here. Jim. Okay, then. Where you at, Wilder? Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! I'm ready! Let's get it, Deante! Let's go! No more excuse. Forget Joshua. Joshua doesn't be ready in time. Let's do this. June, live at O2. Let's get it! I'm number one, baby! Let's go! If he beats me, you write me a check of one pound, yeah? If, if I beat him, you give me your purse against Tony and your TV rights. Yes. No. No? So, Don't worry the, deal about is, the deal is keep, there anyway. Keep, okay, keep going, what you're, keep doing what you're doing. Good so luck with your career. It. Exactly. Good luck with your career. And I hope so Tony knocks you out. I know, he won't. I hope but Tony knocks you out. Good luck Tony career. knocks you out. I hope Tony knocks you out. Your name is all over Twitter, and it's always linked to Devin Haney. What's the story there? Put it straight for us from the horse's mouth, so to speak. Devin Haney, where you at? <laughs> Maybe not such a good idea. Okay, ap apologies for that. What is the story with if you cannot swear? Um, I went to Las Vegas for a holiday, me and Jordan Reynolds. I sparred him when I was hungover. My man do six. He, um, he pulled out after four, hurt him in the third, and I chinned him in the fourth. And that's that, and uh, I outmanned him, I gave him a nuggie, sent him home. Oh, yeah! Yeah, Devin Haney might be in the two in the world, but can he do this? Oh, yeah! Nah, he can't, like. 
He's been conning the British public since this pathetic comeback of his. Listen to me right now. Let's be totally honest. Let me stand this David, so let's be totally honest, brother. Them two guys you just fought, I could be, they're in town now. They're actually, they're, they're, working, they're either working on nightclub doors or they're putting the bins away. Them two guys you fought last two were a joke. And you're robbing everybody who pays to come in the arena. Listen, you, you predicted BJ was going to beat me, didn't you? You predicted he was going to be, he got smashed. And you see you, you're going to get smashed too. I don't care how, deep, how dangerous you think you are. We remember what happened when I was an amateur. We remember what happened when I was an amateur and you were fighting for the British title. Me and Pricey spanked you in the gym and the next day you pulled out against Mark Hobson. And you know what? With 10 ounce gloves on, boy, I'll put you and that pathetic haircut to sleep. Believe that. So, believe that. How does this fight happen? Because the WBC... Listen, I don't care. Listen, SpongeBob SquarePants. I'll deal with you in a boxing. I don't fear you. You've got this big order on yourself. I don't care. I get 10 ounce gloves on and I don't care. I smashed your buddy, your playmate, your playboy, your nightclub buddy, and I will smash you the exact same way. So would you do it at heavyweight? I will do it anywhere. I'll go to his weight. He's really a cruiserweight. If the truth be known, he's the same dimensions as me. I have a little bit more fat and he's a bit better looking. But the top and bottom of it is, he's his dimensions, put him at a cruiserweight. He's six foot three, the same as me. But with that SpongeBob hairstyle, he's about six four. Mike, were you really sick this week? What was the problem? I broke my back. What do you mean by that? You my broke back, back is broken. What, a, a vertebrae or, or well, what portion? Spinal. You did that in sparring? No, I did it um, by a motorcycle accident. The doctor discovered I was doing my sit-ups 2,500 a day with my 20-pound weight, and one day I couldn't move anymore. And I asked the doctor, what's wrong? And he said, um, Believe it or not, it's wearing your back is broken slightly. Kevin Kelly's here tonight, and he's seen, he's seen the skill of the Prince and the strength and the ability and the accuracy and the speed. Oh gosh, you know I'm the best in the world. Have you got a message for Kevin Kelly? He's sitting about seven rows back. He doesn't want to steal your thunder by coming up here and sharing the interview. You've got a message for him, he's listening. No, no, he does want to come up here. Here he is. Here is Kevin Kelly. Have a sit down, Kevin. Here you are. Let's have a chat. Let's have a chat. Now then, what, what, what have you got to say to him now? Can I just say, he's right in front of me, and I can honestly tell him that I'm going to knock him spark out. I'm going to knock your spark out. What have you got to say to that, relax. Kevin? Relax. Relax, baby. You relax. You're going to get knocked out. Let me tell you. In your hometown. Nah, you had a great performance. At New you're nice, York. You're nice and hyped. Madison Excited. Square Garden. But I'm the real I deal. I can't wait to beat you up. I'm the real deal. I I'm can't looking to wait. your face, and I'll tell you the face. Go on, go on, go on. Look I'm at going me to smoke your boots. We'll see. We'll see. Because I am the best featherweight in the world. We will see. So I'll take you out like the rest. I want to say. You can give it all the people hype. Because I know the respect is there. You can give it all the hype in the world, and I can. Yo. But we know who the best featherweight in the world is. And I'm gonna I'm looking you in your eyes. This and I'm is your you house. Kevin, Kevin, just seriously, let me just break this up a minute now. Just tell us what you seriously think about this fellow you as a fighter, because everybody's him. saying this is the best featherweight in the world. The New York accent. Tell him. Well, I feel like this. Calm down. I. I feel like this. You know, I came to uh, England before. I watched Niles fight one time before Tom Johnson. I said they would beat Tom Johnson because the styles make fights. I feel like this. He's a good fighter. He feels he's a good fighter. Hey, if he didn't think he was a good fighter, he could not do the job. I feel I'm the best fighter. He feels he's the best fighter. I was about to say, let's party. I'm a party crasher. I'm going to let down to crash this party. You don't ever give me a face shake, you know that? So I'm gonna let you talk to Victor Ortiz, all right? I'm through. They put somebody else up and give me an interview. What talk are to you Victor talking Ortiz. about? What you, are you, you talking heard about? Him. You never give me a face shake. HBO need to fire you. You don't know about boxing. You ain't. Here, you not. I wish I was 50 years younger you and I'd no kick your ass. You won't do. Do nothing. All praise be to my children. I love you. Oh, oh God, oh, man, what? Is this your shortest fight ever? In any time, amateur, professional ever? Assalamu alaikum, Maida. Um, I don't know, man. Yeah, yeah, Lennox Lewis, Lennox, I'm coming for you. 
Mike, is it frustrating to train like you did and then have no, this in seven or eight seconds? For this fight. I only trained probably two weeks or three weeks for this fight. I had to bury my best friend. And I dedicated this fight. I wasn't going to fight. I dedicated this fight to him. I was going to rip his heart out. I'm the best ever. I'm the most brutal and vicious and most ruthless champion there's ever been. There's no one can stop me. Lynx is a conqueror. No, I'm Alexander. He's no Alexander. I'm the best ever. There's never been anybody as ruthless. I'm Sonny Liston. I'm Jack Dempsey. There's no one like me. I'm from their claw. There's no one that can match me. My style is impetuous. My defense is impregnable. And I'm just ferocious. I want your heart. I want to eat his children. Praise be to Allah. Are you saying now, Mike, that Mike? That's right. Mike.